Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Cameron and welcome to another video. Now I'll start by saying happy Easter. I hope you guys have a good Easter over this one week off that I have anyway. I don't know what you guys have. But anyway, let's get into the video now. As you can see from the screen there, we're going to be doing a road to England now. And today, well, you know, it's a bit of a mixed episode. Because in this first game here, I did this game a while back. But then I did another game straight after that. And it done over. But Elgato didn't process it, which was really annoying. But that team there, it's got some good players in it. But it doesn't have any chemistry. So as you can imagine, you know, they're not going to play it as well. But anyway, Gabby Blondo here, here, straight from kickoff. You know, he just takes it off his man. Well, like, yeah, the other guy's man there. And he literally just calmly slots that one away. His dribbling, his pace, his shooting, it is just so good. Anyway, now getting on to that next highlight. Nathaniel Klein here. Nice shot there. I don't know what he's doing that far up the pitch, to be honest. But yeah, anyway, Danny Ings here as well. He wanted some of the action. You know, honestly, his dribbling is pretty good as well. Him and um, Gabby Blomhoff are very much alike. But unfortunately, Dwight Gale there couldn't finish it off. I don't know. You know, it might be it might be the end of Dwight Gale today. You know, his reign there. But anyway, Gabby Blomhoff here there yet again. Getting a very, very lucky goal there. You know, he's just so good in that can position as well. You know, you'd expect like, Danny Ings and that to be getting loads of goals. But it isn't. Anyway, yeah, anyway, Danny Ings here. He does actually get a goal. I think that might have been one of his first for this club. I'm not quite sure. I haven't done this in a while. So, you know, my knowledge on this isn't so good. But anyway, we have full time there. You know, apart from that, not much really happened. This guy didn't really have many opportunities. And to be honest, I didn't really have any more opportunities after that. But anyway, first of all, we do have two upgrades now. And I decided the first upgrade should be Dwight Gale for Nathan Tyson. I purely picked him because of the pace. You know, his shooting's alright, his dribbling's alright. But, you know, apart from that, not much to go for. Anyway, for the second upgrade, I went and replaced Tompkins with Yagi Elka. Yes, I know, the England centre-backs are non-rare. Gold aren't exactly the most paciest. But, anyway, you know, I thought, yeah, I may as well just go for him. He's the best rated. He has good defender and physical, though. So, you never know, he should do a bit better than Tompkins. Anyway, what EA were thinking when they paired me up with this team... I do not know. It's not exactly as if the um, team ratings are any similar. Be as Suarez, Rodriguez, Benzema, Iniesta, Busquets, uh, Modric, and some inform goalie. Anyway, we do get off to a good start though with Nathan Tyson here getting his first goal for the club on his debut. He just takes the pass to keep it and calmly slots that one away. But you know, I'll tell you about this game now. It went uphill from the start, and then it went downhill dramatically. You know, Danny Ings here, very unlucky. I think it's like Alba that catches up with him or something like that. You know, there's no point trying to beat him there. But anyway, this goal here, I, think, I can't I don't know even know who that was. I think it's Nathaniel Klein trying to do a diving header towards goal. But anyway, he literally just hands the ball to James Rodriguez there. And then literally here as well, Benzema, you know, the defence had like a chance there to kind of learn it. But anyway, here as well, 2v1. Where the defence is, I don't know. It wasn't exactly as if I was on attacking or anything. And, you know, Suarez is going to finish that all day long. Anyway, second chance here. Danny Ings this is in the second half. He hits the flipping crossbar. And then, I don't know, no one's there to follow it up, unfortunately. So, you know, we were very unlucky there. But there, nice goal from him. Cut inside there from Iniesta. You know, I wouldn't really say this guy was massively better than me. It's more the fact that, you know, like defence wasn't happening. But anyway, Butland here. He is literally... Bollocks, he's terrible. Honestly, I was calling him out there, and for some reason, he left the ball to go out for a corner. Anyway, he got the first corner out, but then after this as well, look. James Ward-Prowse, he scores a flipping own goal. He's so retarded, literally. He was at fault for another goal as well, you know, but I didn't really tell you much about that. Anyway, here as well, that's Jack Butland's fault. How he does not get his hands to out, I do not know. Actually, wait, no, that was an offside. Thank God for that. Anyway, you know, this score could be a much worse to score. But anyway, as you see here, yet again, no one's picking up the attackers, and Suarez gets a fifth. You know, could he get another one? Most likely because the defence won't learn. Benzema here, very lucky for him. And yet he gets a sixth goal. Anyway, after that, nothing much really did happen, to be honest. But as you can imagine, you know, we would have to get rid of a player there. But basically, because we're in the last game that I played... That didn't process. I won a gold upgrade, which I then replaced Butland with a gold, like, non rare England um, goalkeeper. So, you know, I'm not going to do that one because, well, I could have just put him in and then downgraded him straight away. But I thought there's no point. I may as well play another game. If that makes any sense, I don't know. Anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed this video, please do leave a like. I do hope you have a good Easter. Peace.